Welcome back, this is Cheryl Terry, and that little noise here in the background is my new hamster, Snowball. I gotta get her in her cage, because it's a little too small. Um, moving on, so if you hear that, that's just her. <laughs> um, we're discussing R.L. Stein's Stuff of Nightmares. I brought this up before because I bought the first issue back in October. Really graphic, but I forgot about it. And they released two new ones as part of the mini series. There's going to be four in the series. Um, R.O. Sign, two Stuff of Nightmares. I got this cover. Um, there's also variant covers. I still haven't got the Tim Jacobos uh, cover. I would love to get that cover, but it's expensive now. Uh, this is number three with the brain. Uh, this one is probably most graphic. Uh, so it's like a retelling of um, our old, not our old side, Frankenstein's monster. Uh, and this one, uh, there's zombies and a lot of people die in book number two. Um, it's pretty graphic for our old science standards. Um, like I said, this is his first uh, for him, more graphic stuff. He has done Fear Street, but a lot of the stuff in Fear Street's fake. Um, but this one is, like I said, graphic. Like he removes this guy's brain and like scoops it out and there's like a step-by-step -step process. And then he puts the brain in a, in a brand new corpse. So there's that. And there's a scene in there with firefighters being eaten uh, and torn apart. So that, that was pretty graphic. I mean, if you watch Walking Dead, you're kind of desens desensitized for it. But if you're looking for good old Goosebumps time, you're like, okay, this is not Goosebumps. But uh, I recommend the series. Um, if you like R.L. Stein in general, want to see what's more adult themes uh, in the series. Yeah, as you can see, he's, he scoops his brother's brain out. Spoilers! Sorry. Um, so yeah, that guy's no longer alive. These are the main uh, antagonists. Uh, the two brothers and her. I don't know what relationship to her to these guys are. She's like a love interest. And this little guy, that's, that's Frankie. He's so cute. Uh, he doesn't actually eat someone, so I, that doesn't actually happen there. He doesn't eat anyone. He just, he can't say very much, and he just follows them around. It's the other failed experiments that you people, but, uh, the last one comes out, uh, next month, December 21st, I believe. Could be wrong, but it is next month. Uh, I'm looking forward to it. I'm kind of sad the series is ending, um, but hopefully I'll be able to get Tim Jacobo's, uh, Goosebump variant of, um... Stuff on nightmares. Hopefully one day. This is Char of Cherry. If you like this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and say hi. I also on YouTube. Uh, catch up here.